Greetings, YouTube! Nick Rufio MX here, and I hope you've all really enjoyed the ActRaiser playthrough that just finished a little earlier today. Uh, if you're watching this video, the eighth and final ActRaiser video is up, so you, you know, if you haven't seen the end of it, you might want to go check that out. Um, that being said, I wanted to talk a little bit about the next feature. Um, the next feature will be another full playthrough walkthrough thingy kind of thing with a face um, of this game here. Just grab it. Dragon Age Origins. I have the Ultimate Edition here, which also includes Awakening. Dragon Age Origins Awakening. Now, I'm actually not going to be doing uh, Dragon Age Origins Awakening in the playthrough. I'm going to be doing Origins, and uh, it has a list here of a lot of the DLC that came with it. Uh, the Stone Prisoner, I'll be doing that. Warden's Keep, I'll be doing. Return to Ostagar, I'll be doing. Darkspawn Chronicles, I will not be doing. Liliana's Song, I will not be doing. Golems of Amgarak, I will not be doing. Witch Hunt, I will not be doing. So basically, I'm only doing the DLC that actually um, inserts itself into the main narrative of Dragon Age Origins. Now, this is one of the best CRPGs that's computer style or western style RPG of the past 10 years um, and I've been looking forward to doing this for a really long time and I know a lot of people that I've mentioned it to have been looking forward to seeing the playthrough but I did want to warn you guys I wanted to give sort of a we'll say parental advisory now obviously I'm an adult and um, when I do my videos I'm pretty free about what I say I tend to say things that could be seen as controversial. Um, I curse a lot, you know? So I'm not really aiming my channel at children by any, by any stretch of the imagination. But I am aware that I do have a lot of younger viewers, and that's okay. Um, that's okay. You know, I, 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 I didn't know this actually until I started doing the VMX show, and I started to get guests on that were as young as like 13 years old who were into all these like old games and everything which is really cool because it's really cool to see the younger generation and young kids that are into things that I was into at that age um but that being said you know I don't normally do this type of thing but Dragon Age Origins is not only an M-rated game and it's not the first M-rated game that I've done a full playthrough of that would be Mortal Kombat. I did a playthrough of Mortal Kombat. Mortal Kombat was pretty violent, but um, I just wanted to talk about Dragon Age Origins because I'm just going to read you what it says on this. M for Mature 17 Plus, Blood and Gore, Intense Violence, Language, Partial Nudity, and Sexual Content. Um, now, there's nothing, in, in terms of like the, the nudity and the, and the sex, there's nothing too bad in it. Um, the sex scenes are actually kind of censored because the the characters are like in their underwear, so they're not really showing any sort of you don't see any boobs or butts or naughty bits. You don't you don't really see anything. Uh, it's actually kind of funny because there's this one character Morrigan that she has a really really revealing outfit, like full cleavage, you know, under boob, side boob, almost full boob, and then when she takes it off. She's wearing a bra, which she clearly wasn't when she had it on. So when she takes her clothes off and then she like puts on even more clothes, she's actually more covered up when she's in her underwear, which is amusing. But and the sex scenes are really just like real quick, awkward. It's nothing that you couldn't see on television, but there is sex in it. Um, as for the nudity, um, like there's a few enemies that have like a little nipple hanging out. It's not that big a deal, but I want to make you aware of it. It's nothing too bad, um, and you're not gonna really you know, see anything that's going to uh, warp your mind or anything. It is an extremely, extremely violent game. There's, there's, there's blood, there's guts, there's torture, there's all sorts of stuff. And it's a, it's a very dark storyline, a very mature storyline. So I just wanted to make everyone aware that Dragon Age Origins is probably the most adult game that I've ever played on the channel. You know, um, not counting ridiculous Atari porn like Custer's Revenge, which I, I don't know if you could really call that an adult because it's really, really immature. But um, I just wanted to warn it because, uh, you know, because uh, um, just don't watch when your parents are around, you know? 
or if you're sensitive, just don't watch, please. I, I, I don't really need any comments like, oh my god, what are you uploading? People getting their heads cut off, and then they're having sex, and there's all this stuff. And it, it's really not that bad. Like I said, it's it's if this was a movie, it would be rated R mostly for violence. Um, so that being said, I just wanted to make everybody aware of that. And I felt that I should just do the responsible thing because, I mean, I've been in GameStop where I've had, uh, I've seen parents buying games for their kids and, uh, you know, they were, they would ask me like, uh, I don't work there, but I get these questions anyway, for some reason, like, like what's a good game for a kid who's like into like, like dragons and like fantasy and that kind of stuff. And you'll see their eye kind of go to Dragon Age, and they'll say, well, how old are they? Oh, they're 13. Yeah, you don't want to get that one. Then. So I just wanted to um, let you guys know that I am doing Dragon Age Origins. It is a very, 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 very M-rated game. But I did also want to say that unlike most games with the M on it, it actually is mature. Most of them are should be called I for immature. Because they usually are. But in this case, this is a really cool game. That's actually going to start tomorrow. I wasn't going to do videos tomorrow, but I had to take yesterday off. So, uh, Necro VMX out. Hope you enjoy the next feature. Um, and like I said, if you're a young kid, I'm not going to tell you to not watch it. Because it's really up to you. Um, but I'm going to say you might want to do it when your parents aren't in the room. Because it could raise some awkward questions. Uh, there's nothing pornographic about it, but I just wanted to give you a fair warning. So that being said, Naker VMX out.